how's it going guys welcome back to the f1 career mode part two we're heading to the bah bahrain grand prix i have done some stuff off camera before we even get to there uh you can see in the activities we have a sponsor event fundraiser that will uh, increase our team uh, acclaim by 100 cash will go down by 5,000. Uh, that will take up all of our off time we head to the facilities nothing has been done here yet as you guys know it takes up a uh, a lot of money to really improve any of this area so this is gonna have to wait a little bit um, we could improve some of the chassis area, but I'm going to save some of that money for now and uh, not do that at the moment. Uh, R&D is where we did a lot of the work, so I'll run down everything that we did. We went to the aerodynamics, and we, ha we have two upgrades coming in here. We have uh, in development the front wing main flap and the rear wing main uh, plane. So let's go to the chassis. We have two, uh, one development here, actually. We have the rear four under tray uh, that is in development as well. Uh, and then we have in durability, we have a gearbox durability up uh, getting in development as well. Now, all of these are hopefully coming in. I think the gearbox is hoping to come in uh, April 6th, so right after the Vietnam Grand Prix. Uh, the aerodynamic upgrades are hoping to come in right around April 1st, so right before the Vietnam Grand Prix. And then chassis is somewhere around that April or April 6th to April 4th area as well. So it's gonna take some time, but uh, we're doing that uh, as well. I will be working to get more R&D points off camera by doing uh, practice sessions. So for example, as soon as we go to the Gra Grand Prix weekend, you will see the qualifying session. Before that, I will be doing uh, all the practice programs and trying to raise those resource points uh, so we get uh, quick as fast as we can possibly. And you know, right now we kind of suck, so it's gonna take a while. Uh, we have made a few changes to the car livery as well. So you can see uh, there is a little bit of a darker blue than what is previously on there. And we also have some of the logos in that kind of neon yellowish color with a second sponsor as well if you could see uh zanetto right 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 above the driver's head there that is the second sponsor that we have placed in the car is also on the uh rear wing flap over there and this is where we hired that second sponsor uh we have to answer at least two interview questions during a race weekend it was one of the easier uh, goals to use and right now that's kind of what we want is we want those easy goals get that money uh kind of quickly there's other ones like get 10 constructor championship points or uh get the fastest lap in the race we can't do that kind of stuff you know that's that's not really possible at the moment here are the standings in case you missed the first episode botas Vettel, leclerc hamilton and ocon round out the top five in terms of driver's points and uh we as hendrick f1 yes that is the other change i have made off camera uh, you guys said uh to choose a different name hendrick f1 you know so a lot of you said rabin racing is good as well but uh we will be doing hendrick f1 uh i'm going to keep the logo the same that that r just to implement some of my little personal taste in there so you know you know this is real rabin's career uh there's the the logo for the r but this is hendrick f1 uh so the hendrick f1 team with uh radman and schumacher so that is pretty much everything i did pretty much uh i can't think of anything else that i did no i didn't do anything else I did change the suit, but this wasn't really something I did today. I just, you know, that's one of the Michael Schumacher sh uh, suits. Um, we changed the helmet a little bit, so we have some of the logos on there uh, with the colors as well. Uh, change the gloves. I have some. I actually like some of the Schumacher um, gloves, so I decided to put some of those as well. Podium emote. We won't be seeing the podium anytime soon. And uh, character poses. Just the arms crossed. You know, we're all business, baby. So now that we are all caught up, uh, this race, because I am low on time, I don't have as much time, will also be 25%. But I'm hoping for the future uh, to do more 50% races. So only this race here and maybe a few more will be 25%. But I do want to do 50% races because uh, I do know there the strategy implements a little bit more. We have a better chance of getting points that way. More reliability, reliability issues come. Maybe the chance of rain as well. So I definitely want to do 50% races. But just for today, I have to do a 25% race. So hopefully everyone's okay with that. So let's go. We're going to advance time. Get that uh, acclaim from the sponsor event and the fundraiser. Apparently we could get another sponsor. Uh, let's well, see if we could do that uh we already have one of these sponsors on the car and no we cannot i already did that so i did that before the game even let me know but yeah uh we can definitely do that so we're going to bahrain it's going to be the night race at bahrain international circuit let's see how we do all right guys we are here for qualifying uh i did the practice program spent a lot of time in practice we were not good in practice uh to say the least we were about seven tenths off our teammate um so i don't know if it's just the track or if it's just me just being really slow uh the car really lacks down for us and you guys know bahrain it's a lot of tight uh kind of corners turn 10 especially the downhill braking zone 
it's uh, we're, we're struggling. Uh, we're struggling for a mix of straight uh, straight line speed and, but I mean, especially the downforce is just horrendous. It's it's really really bad. I've been trying to mix around with the setups. I've gone from maximum downforce to maximum top speed. I've tried each one of these setups in practice, and uh, obviously the maximum downforce feels a lot better, but we're slow. Maximum top speed. We have a little bit faster lap times, but it's an absolute handful to just even try and do it's anything. I'm going to go with a, uh, I think maybe a, just a normal balance setup, try to get a mix of the two. There's not much we could do, to be honest. It's, uh, it's just the car itself is uh, really struggling, so we'll try our best. All right, guys, so in a pleasant surprise, we're not actually doing terribly. Uh, Hamilton's on pole. We are only three-tenths off of Schumacher, which is much better than practice. Um, I guess the car just feels a little bit better. One with the balance set up and two in qualifying trim. I don't know. It just feels a little bit better. So uh, I feel like even the lap I ran was not that good. We lost a lot of time in sector three, um, a lot of time in sector two. We are faster than Schumacher in second one. So uh, let's try our best here to get in front of our teammate, qualify P17 maybe. I mean, that's that's possible. It's like the leaderboard. Grosjean is, you know, we, I mean, we could we could get up to, we could beat the Haas cars. I'm, I'm confident if I could get a lap time to beat the Haas cars. It just has to be a perfect lap, so let's see what happens. we go that's uh oh look at that that corner i really messed it up last time so six tenths up let's go using up literally all the track that's extending track limits to be honest but eight tenths up let's go That is a good lap. I will take that. That's gonna beat our teammate. That's gonna. That's a real. I'm really proud of myself. Oh man, that's a good lap. P13. Oh my god. Holy crap. I don't know what was going on in practice, man. That is amazing. Amazing. Oh my. I'm so happy with that. All right, Mercedes, Ferrari, Red Bull, take the top six. Look at us! <laughs> oh my god, yes! I'm so happy with that. I am so, so happy with that. Um, I don't think we're going to be able to hold that in the race. Uh, the thing about Bahrain, this really slow corners, it's really hard for me to get traction off the corners with this car. So I don't think we're going to be able to finish P13 in the race. But man, if we could just hold off some of the fields, that is a great, great qualifying position. I am ex I, I did not think that was possible. I really nailed that lap. It, the downhill turn 10... I mean, you saw me locking up into there, but I carried a lot of speed in there, and I didn't, it didn't really mess up. It was, uh, that was fantastic. I'm so happy with it. The stage is set for another enthralling race here in the kingdom of Bahrain. A Ferrari stronghold in years gone by, but will they be able to add to their record today? We'll be racing around 3.36 miles of the magnificent Bahrain International Circuit today. Keep an eye out for drivers locking the front left down into the tricky braking zone of Turn 10. Anthony Davidson is here once again for today's Grand Prix. Why don't we start by talking about Valtteri Bottas? That was a great win in the last race. Can they keep that momentum going this weekend? It's always nice to come into a Grand Prix weekend on a high, but your expectations are based much more on your practice and qualifying runs. So it's the momentum from those sessions that they'll be hoping to carry into the race today. It's time to see how our drivers are stacking up after yesterday's exciting qualifying session. Lewis Hamilton lines up on pole position and Valtteri Bottas will line up alongside. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Leclerc, Vettel, Alexander Albon, and Verstappen, Sainz, Ricardo, Perez, and Lando Norris, Ocon, Gasly, Oldtimer, and Raikkonen, Kvyat, Stroll, Kevin Magnussen, and Roman Grosjean, Schumacher, Giovinazzi, Russell, and Nicholas Latifi. Which of these talented drivers will come out on top today? 
All right, guys, so this is the strategy for the race. My plan really is, because I know I'm not going to have the race pace to compete, stay on the medium tires, hold up the pack as long as I possibly can, get on the soft tires at the end, and if we do lose a few spots and we're battling with the Williams or the Haas or, you know, even with our own teammate, we're going to have that soft tire at the end. The only problem with this strategy is that we are banking on there not being a safety car. If there is a safety car... Uh, we're going to get into some trouble. So hopefully this, there's no safety car and this will get us the best possible finish uh, that I think is possible. Um, and we'll see how it goes. So let's go to the race. Oh boy. I'm kind of nervous since we qualified pretty well. Uh, that was not a good start. Yeah, okay. Nope, not the best of starts. Let's get to the inside. Come on. Man, Raikkonen sent it in there. Oh my god. We're on the outside. Are we in the top 10? Oh my god, we're in the top 10. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, wait, no, we're not. Verstappen's gonna say no thank you on that. Uh, he's still down there somewhere. Uh, no, that's not Verstappen, that's a Renault. I don't know what's going on. Oh god, we made contact with the Renault. Sorry. I kind of cut Ricardo off there, but I mean. I had the racing line, to be honest. I was ahead, so fair play. All right, this is where we put it into rich. I don't have a lot of fuel. I took a lot of the fuel out, which is probably not a good idea, actually, in hindsight. But I really need this car to not weigh a lot at the beginning of this race because we really need to defend. But then again, now I need to save a lot of fuel during the race. So I didn't realize I took that much fuel out. I still wanted just, like, plus one. But uh, I guess we took too much out, so... Go back into standard for now, save some of it for uh, when DRS comes in, because then we're going to be really screwed. I'm also going to put it in lean at every every possible moment, so right now I have it in lean. I think we have a little bit of a gap on Ricardo that I think I can defend. Let's go back into standard. Alright, uh, yep, we're going to defend that. And get back on the throttle. Okay, Alright, good. The top 10. Let's go back into lean. Alright, let's stay through lean all the way through sector 2. I'm going to be such a nuisance. I, this is literally my entire strategy this race. Whoa, why are you trying to make a move there? You can't make a move there, Ricardo. That's, no. I'm just going to park my car and just hold up the entire field. That's what we're doing. This is what we're going to do to get a good finish. All right, let's go back into a standard. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, Ricardo's pissing me off. Oh, no, I locked up the brakes. Oh, we let Verstappen get by. I mean, he's not, he's making passes in a very weird way. That's not where you make a pass. If you just get down the straightaway, you know, then you make a pass. Then. Yeah, but he's making, like, outside moves, dive bombing into corners. You're not supposed to dive bomb it in. I mean, that's some pretty aggressive moves. Oh. Almost lost it. We're fine. I'm really struggling right now, though. I have no grip in this thing. Let's go into Rich for a little bit. Try to defend from Kvyat. He's going to go to the outside. We're going to defend. And we got the move back in front, and let's go back into lean. I would say the plan is going pretty much perfectly at the moment, just in terms of holding everyone up. Going in lean all through sector two. Go back into standard here. Let's not lock up the brakes. I still lock up the brakes. My God, I can't get the brake pressure right in turn 10. It's really difficult. Uh, they have DRS, so we go into rich for sector three. Try and defend. Hopefully this works. Down to fourth gear, do the looping left left hander, get on the curb a little bit. That was too much. Oh, made a little bit of contact. Side by side. Yeah, that was my fault. That I mean, I'm surprised I wasn't penalized there, and I'm completely losing concentration. That was reckless. We're lucky not to have been penalized. Yeah, I know. Thank. I know I'm not. Okay. Wow, that's a lot of speed there. Can I get a DR set the straight? Yeah, I might have DRS. All right, we can make the move back. Oh wait, he's going to pit road. Gap to car in front is an early stop. Seven seconds. Okay. Probably realized they were losing so much time being behind my slow ass. <laughs> Alphatari was like, you know what? Come in, come in. This is just no point. All right, another series of defending with Ricardo right on our tail. Let's get a better run through here. That's more like it. Perfect. All right, we're keeping it rich all the way through sector three. Same thing, we go into sector two. That's why we go down a lean. But until then, just sector three, all the way through rich. 
keep Ricardo behind us. All right, we're having a good enough gap now. Let's go back into standard. I wonder how much of a run he's going to get. Oh, that's a big enough run. Going to Rich, going to Rich. All right, he's going to make a move to the bottom. I'm going to try to outbreak him. Stay on the outside. Beautiful defending. All right, he's going to come back again, though. Now let's take the inside and make him go out. Uh, actually, we're good. Yeah, he never made the move. All right, now I got to go into lean. All right, there we go. Perfect. Absolutely perfect defending. I'm so proud of myself right now. I'm, I'm, there's just so many things going on. I have to remember, you know, put the fuel in a certain place. Don't overdrive the corners. Just keep the car parked here. <sighs> so difficult. We just have to survive three more laps until we can come down and get the pit road. That was risky. Um, trying to stay away from Norris. He's going to have DRS. So we have to stay in rich here. Hopefully he comes down to the pits. That'd be great. Let's see if he boxes. Come on, go down pit road. Nope, he's not. All right. Well, now we have to defend from the McLaren. There's no way we're defending that. No, that's no way. Oh god, here comes Stroll too. No. Oh, we made contact. All right. All right. All right, Lando. That's an impressive move. At least we have DRS to defend from Stroll here. And we're going to be just fine. Oh, my God. This is stressful. You know how hard it is to defend when your car is this slow? Oh, my God. All right. Another set of defending. I think they have to come down pit road this time, right? I'm pretty sure this is their scheduled lap. Oh, no. We're only on lap six. Now they're going one more lap. I think yeah, they are. All right. Uh, do I give Stroll? I'm going to give Stroll the inside. Yeah, I'm going to try to keep it around the outside. We have no chance. I can't even get to the outside. All right. Yeah, there's no defending that. And there's a caution. Yellow flag. That completely caution. messed me up. Caution. Lewis Hamilton's out of the session. And where's my teammate coming from? Okay, clear. We just got overtaken by our teammate. I have no idea where he... You know, actually, I'm... I'm happy about that. You know, he's not really our rival. We own him. So go Shumi, go. Okay. Hopefully Shumi can run down Stroll. But uh, Lewis Hamilton out of the session. Big implications there. I mean, he's not having the greatest season. Uh, season finished fourth at Australia. Now he's out of the session. Probably Botas still leading. So big, big scenes here. Let's just stay right behind Shumi. Oh, my God. We're fine. I have no traction in this car. chassis department. We got to get to work. We are pitting this lap, so bucks, 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 bucks. And let's see if we could get a fast in lap. It's going to be very important. And we have a McLaren right on. You know, oh, God, don't make that move. Why are you trying to make that move? You can't pass there. That's that's not a passing point. Like, you can make a pass in a heavy braking zone. You can't pass there. That completely messed us up. Carlos signs you absolute twat. I can't believe you just done this. But it is okay, I guess. Oh, my God. That dirty air. All right. Let's keep going, though. Let's try not to let that ruin our... I mean, it did ruin our inlet, but... I just don't understand why the AI are trying to pass there. That's not a passing part point on this on this track. What, what is wrong with you people? All right. Time to come in. Let's go. All right. Beautiful. Okay. So... We have a terrible in-lap. Um, if I can be within two seconds of shoot me, just give me two seconds, I, I can make that up on soft go, tires. Go, go. So we'll see where we line up. Kefiat, Stroll, there's Grosjean and Schumacher. Go, go, go. And we lost a good amount of spots. Yeah, not the best there. But, we are on soft tires. We have a shot here. Let's try to get around Magnuson. On the outside. I got him. I got him. I got him. Let's go! Another move. Oh, what a dive bomb. Absolutely knocked his tire out. Sorry, Giovanazzi. I'm sorry. You know, I hit you square in the wheel, though, so it's okay. 
All right, next up is Russell. We have someone slow up here. Not sure who it is. DRS, let's go. I can't believe I see a Williams running 15th. That's insane. We have to get these guys now before our tires fall off a cliff. So this, this is really, really important right here. As I overdrive that corner a little bit, I'm just gonna use all the track over here. Let's get behind George. He's gonna block. Oh, look at that. Straight line speed, my goodness. Can we go around the outside? No. We're gonna cut back. We're gonna wait. Oh, little tap. Okay, I didn't think that was gonna work at all. But no damage on the car, right? No, we're good. Okay, good all right, good. Great pass. let's go. And, uh, crap. No, no, he's not getting run. All right, we're good. We're good. Let's keep going. Up next is our teammate. I'm going to put it in a standard for now. Let's see we if he can make a move on Ricardo. And Grosjean is actually the one slowing everyone down right now, which is really interesting. We could get up to P12. A P12 finish would be insane. I would be so happy with that. All right, well, this is going to be interesting. I don't think I'm going to gain any time on, on our teammate because he's going to have DRS. We're literally in the same car. I don't know how this is going to work. We are a little bit closer, though. Not the best of runs to the final turn. There's the DRS. I have it in rich, but not really gaining any time. Gonna have to wait. I know I can get up to Grosjean if we could just get around Schumacher. I can make a move right here. Oh boy, I think that was a little bit of contact, but we are fine. No wing damage on Schumacher. We're good. There we go. Oh, this is going to be terrible. Locking up the left front. All right, we're fine. All right, let's go hunt down Grosjean. Realistically, this is going to be the last position we could get in this race because Ricardo is gone. We're not going to catch him. This would be a huge position to get. We could beat a Haas car. That would be really, really good. That's kind of one of my goals to is to beat Haas. Front, but we need let's to see if we get him. We won't be making another pit stop. Meanwhile, I'm hoping my teammate... I'm hoping Schumacher could hold off the rest of the pack. That would be huge if he could finish the 15th as well. That would be a great result for the team. It's kind of weird, you know. Usually in the F1 games, you want to beat your teammate. Now it's like, all right, come on, teammate, let's go. We need you to do well. So it's kind of, it's kind of weird. We to there, but two, no, to mix two. I refuse to move to mix two. That's not happening. No, we have uh, mix three going in right now. We have still have a lap left in the tank. Let's go get Grosjean, baby. We're gonna get a good run through here. Get on the power. Oh, I almost lost it there. We're fine. He does not have DRS. We do. Come on. Come on. Oh my god, look at that Ferrari engine go. Even with DRS, we're going to go to the outside here. Pinch him down. We're going to get the run here. Boom. And that is exactly why I chose the outside. So we can get that next corner there. Perfect. Let's go back into standard and let's try to finish out this race. Two laps to go for an amazing result. So happy with it. White flag lap, Ricardo's five seconds this ahead. Grosjean is eight tenths. Schumacher's not in 15th, so that sucks. I don't know where he is right now, but uh, I mean, good day for us. I'm really hoping Schumi can hang on to the best result possible. It'll be a great day for the team, but uh, Grosjean's not gonna catch us. He's actually low on fuel, so. Beautiful scenes, let's bring it home. Whoa, look at the fireworks. Incredible. I don't even know who won the race. Oh, Leclerc. Claire won the race. A Ferrari. What happened to Botas? Maybe Botas and Hamilton made contact, and that's why um, Hamilton was out of the race. Or Hamilton could have just had a uh, mechanical failure. Either one. But uh, it's going to be an amazing result for Hendrick F1. I mean, just incredible. I'm really, really happy. I was not expecting this. I mean, especially during the practice sessions, guys. Off camera and during the practice sessions, I mean, we were just not good. So, uh... It's a pleasant surprise. The strategy paid off beautifully, having the soft tires there at the end to make the moves. And it's going to be a 13th okay, place finish. Really, home. really happy with that. Moving on to the next race. I'm kind of mad I don't get driver of the day. I mean, Ocon got it. Understandable, but I mean, we're taking a brand new team up to P13. Schumacher ended up 17th, so I'm really happy about that. Hamilton with a DNF. I'm not really sure what happened there. Um, Botas in 15th? What in the... Uh, I don't know what happened there. So, it, Mercedes with an absolute terrible, terrible race. And, uh, I we finished ahead of a Mercedes. I, I can't believe that. Okay, Albon second, Vettel third, Ocon. Okay, mix. 
All right, 11th to fourth in a Renault. Yeah, that's, that's driver of the day. So good job for Ocon. Perez, Sainz, Verstappen, Raikkonen. Good run for Raikkonen, Lando, and Lance Stroll. All right, guys. So that is going to be it for uh, this one. We have the Vietnam Grand Prix up next with the front wing main flap and rear wing main, uh, main plane coming in, hopefully without failure, really hoping uh, that that comes in. Um, we also have a little bit of time before then in between to uh, do uh, some stuff. So we're going to see how this goes. I will see you guys later. Hope you're having a great day. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram if you're not already. Subscribe if you're new. And uh, yeah, hopefully I don't make that mistake with the stupid game audio again. That really upset me. So uh, sorry about that. I will see you guys later. Great, great result for us. So it was awesome. Peace out.